left. That is so cool. Headlights. It ain't helping. Believe you. I'm gonna walk it. That looks pretty cool. Yeah, I know, we have masks on still, but it's the rules here, you get tossed out. Yay! Welcome to Pennsylvania. <laughs> but Deb and I are at Christmas Village. We haven't been out here for quite a few years. Uh, luckily, they were open this year, so we decided to come out and uh, have fun. take some time off of the mill <laughs> and everything else we're doing around right now. So, a little holiday time for ourselves. So, but If you guys don't know about this place, I think it's pronounced Kozar's Christmas Village in Pennsylvania. Look it up. It's supposedly known around the world, but it's a really cool looking place out here in the countryside. It's got an iron and oak sawmill plug in there off your sweat, your your hoodie. <laughs> oh yeah, I mean I could. I've been on. Let's see what's in here. Yeah. I'm not getting a picture. I'm getting video. <laughs> Of course, the line to see the big guy is real long. I think Deb's waiting in it. I don't know where she went. <laughs> oh yeah, he's all the way there in the back. 
Back there somewhere, guys. Get your list into them real quick. There you go. Hi. <laughs> Back again. I had to stop and do a little shop and get a t shirt or a sweatshirt. I might just put that sweatshirt on tonight. I'm, I'm layered up, but I'm still a little chilly. Spent the day out on the mill milling uh, white oak beans. So, I don't know what you guys think of the place. Put it down in the comment section and let us know. Yes, please. <laughs> Uh oh, Deb's in trouble. We're heading over the bridge. Oh, missed it. Do it again. Better. <laughs> there you go. Put the mask back on. Uh oh. It's funny, I say, and I'm trying to take less. This place would be packed full of stuff. Yeah. So much stuff you gotta zoom back to get it all in. Busy, busy, busy. Hey, I don't see a new sawmill in there. No, I don't either. Well, wood miser is behind the production, so maybe I'll get it in spring. Farm life in Berks County, Deb says. I wish we had this much land. <laughs> Got the big old house, small barn down there. Over on this side, you got the big barn and the cows, as the Dutchmen say, all the cows. We got the firehouse. Hey, they don't have an ambulance station in here. Where's the ambulance station? Just the firehouse. <laughs> yeah, Reading line. That's the size that Daddy wants to yeah, give you guys. That one is up on up there. Uh, up top. There's one around the truck. This year for the lucky people. If I could get in. Uncle Lucky! Yeah! It's a subway. Look, here comes another one really fast. Lots of these little displays along the way here. Just walk through this little village of all these Christmas displays. The kids are loving it, I'll tell you that.
Talk about the big guy. He's a very big guy. <laughs> Yeah, he's the big guy. Let's get Deb up there. But you can't sit on his lap, so what are you gonna do? What are you asking for Christmas? I want a kitty cat. Okay, you've already got a kitty cat. What else do you want? I know. Think really hard. My kitty cat. <laughs> no, an LT40 wide. Come on. <laughs> oh, excuse us. Whew. I think we need one of these to have on a horse. What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> Man, there's some old sleds in here. I think we need one, hi. There you go. One like that, just you and me. Yeah. That's nice. These are cool. Like there's a picture of it. Yeah. Where am I right you to these are all originals, folks. Nice antiques. No, I don't know what kind of wood they're made out of. <laughs> There's this one. That's that one there, I believe, yep. Man, these are cool. A few indoor things here. <laughs> this was a room where all the trains used to run. I don't think they had the train display anymore. <laughs> Deb's trying to pick out a Christmas ornament for the tree. Yes, by the way, we get a real tree. We climb the hill at the farm, the Christmas tree farm, and cut it down every year. Yep. We'll take the sleigh. Please. There you go. Anything else? Do you see any others? Oh no, I'm looking. Lots to look at. I like the... What's that? The hat and the box, yeah. maybe. One of the bears. We have lots of bears. We have bears. Yeah. Pair of boots. You don't have boots, do you? Well, I'm just looking at stuff. Yeah, they have tractors down here. They don't have any mini sawmills put on the tree. We decorate our tree with miscellaneous handmade or unique ornaments. I made a few in the shop. They're on the tree. There's some on the tree when, when, when I was in Cub Scouts. And some from before that got from my parents, so we'll just add to the add to the tradition here. Well, if you need, if you need a Christmas decorations, this is a good place to get them. This one is still going. This one's been around a while. Those dancing marionettes, they've been dancing here for years. There you go. Okay, well, there's fudge, so Deb picked the right place to go in. This, she'll be grabbing some of this. Guess what? They do have the train here. Right up in front of us. We're going to come take a look at that in a minute. Don't forget hot chocolate. <laughs> well, here you go, folks. Here I thought they uh, got rid of this. I thought it was back in the other building.
Jeff to the rescue with hot chocolate. Thank you. It's crowded in here. We're going to eat out. Hang on, huh? Everybody, uh, we're about to wrap it up here, but uh, we wanted to put this video out for everybody out there on the channel watching us here and uh, helping us out. I'd just like to wish everybody a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. And whatever you celebrate this time of year, have a great time and enjoy it. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, everybody, from the Iron and Oak Sawmill. Happy New Year.